and welcome back to Song Reaction Analysis with your girl JVB. My little dance move. That's not a good dance move. Wow! <laughs> I don't know. Ah, oh, whatever. Welcome back to my channel. I am a singer, songwriter, music producer, and composer. I am a vocal performance coach, a song reactor, and a goofball, obviously. With no further ado, if you haven't yet, make sure that you subscribe to my channel, like, and hit the notification bell so you never miss a post of mine. We have another song by Adani, which is one of our favorites. Um, and it's actually a song, I believe I already did the music video, but I haven't done the One Fast Married 2021. And that's what I wanted to check out. It came highly recommended. It's got 888 likes. I love that number. I want to like the video, but I don't want to mess up that number. Okay, just so you know, I'm 889. Yes, I did it. <laughs> I love this band and um, I can't wait to see this performance. It's from the One Fest <clears throat> Merit 2021. And um, <clears throat> I have something in my throat. Now that I've cleared my throat, as a singer, I just want to say that it's one of the worst things you could do. You should never like <clears throat> do that because your vocal cords kind of bang each other, beat each other up other beat each other up <laughs> uh, but once in a while you gotta do what you gotta do right so Idani living dad one fast married 2021 I'm so excited I love that band and um, I know you guys love them so let's check it out and I love music videos but obviously I really love seeing live performances so let's get straight to it I love those lights. I love his voice, especially when he goes up to the high note. Oh my God, he's belting it out so solid. So good. I'm a big sucker for like a nice intro. I love how they did their intro like for a whole minute, just like building up the tension, building it up, you know, to start the song. The stage setup is awesome and it's like so fits their image. I love that. And I, I, their sound is just like so 
I love how they're all spread out like that. Um, the lights are amazing. And it's a cool song. That song is so hooky. Um, I want to go back to here one more time. I like the whole way it, it starts. Um, is it here? Yeah, here we go. Super powerful. Mm. that solo um solid performance i really 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 dig that um it's like it, it again it, that song reminds me like of just like the 90s like just going to like a metal show and just you know throwing down <laughs> it's it's just so solid come back to here no, no. 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 break down in his voice.
there's something so gritty in his voice and yet he has so much control over it you can tell that these guys have been around for a while and like they master the instruments they that song in particular i feel is like such a awesome hooky song and such great song structure it's so oh my god it sticks with you you know even it's it's such a it's a really classic to me like metal rock song that is like it has all the amazing elements that you want like a guitar solo badass drums like in general amazing musicianship great building of the song a little breakdown and most importantly for me personally i love a good hook because that's what how we remember songs right and they have all of that in that song and obviously the attitude is there the singer has such a great voice like really fitting for the music they are playing um and i love the way the song just progresses it was really really cool and you know it's it's also cool to see sometimes it's not like sounds are not always optimal you know like in, in a life situation because things a little bit off balance so that that really shows musicianship when you're in a situation where the sound is not perfect it's not like the record obviously right because it's a live performance so that shows when the musicians the players are really professional and really good they can still perform 100% even if the sound is not 100% so I feel like they mastered that so much great performance great I like the whole stage setup and the lighting I love the song I love the performance awesome I'm, I'm glad I checked that out um they have great energy and I'm sure it's even like better if it's like at a real like festival where you can see like the people and you know like they're really engaging because all these factors play a huge role in a band's performance it's like it's so hard when you're performing and the audience is not quite engaging or that it's like a really big place like that's why bands even big bands always love to actually play in smaller venues because the, the the energy is a bit easier to be exchanged between the audience and the performer because you you it's a bit more intimate right so the bigger the venue the less intimate the performance is and it can really affect a band's performance um a because the sound quality um just because you have all professional sound people there that doesn't mean it's going to sound amazing uh, especially not for the band because when a band is um doing like a little checkup like checkup Oh my god what am i talking about when when you do a sound check usually you know the the venue is empty so it sounds completely different than when all the people are coming in so that sound there's so many things that go into it you know when you when bands are performing um so i'm just bringing that up because um people that sometimes you know judge bands or their live performance like, eh, it wasn't good or the sound blah 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 it's not really the band's fault for most of the part uh, 100% 90% of the time it's not the band's fault but also it affects everything it affects your performance it affects your 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 mood you know because everything's energy so I really love what they did with this song I love that and the performance really really awesome and yeah the song is super super hooky song love it it's hooky and it's heavy and it's got all the good stuff in it love it um if i would have to rate it one to ten i would definitely give it a ten because i think the song is really great um and um yeah i look forward to more adani let me know in the comments below what should be the next adani song reaction um on this channel and or other similar bands i know we did like, did like burger kill um there's so many amazing artists uh so i want to like definitely like check out other bands but i really love them and i want to check out more of their stuff i looked at their website but they don't have a lot of newer stuff up so i'm not sure what's up with that but regardless i don't want to make this video too long i appreciate you so much i always love you commenting sending links um definitely subscribing and liking if you haven't yet make sure you do that right now right this second <laughs> and i want to leave you with something positive as always make every day a great day what you do i like to say how you do one thing is how you do everything so be really cautious and 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 aware of what you do where you spend your energy and your time because it's so easy to waste a day away to waste a dream away and uh, whatever you want make sure that you stay focused laser focused on what you want and don't even 
worry about things not being in your life at the moment if they are not because as long as you stay focused as long as you stay with your eyes peeled on the price on your goals you will get there eventually things will show up things will align when you allow them to align versus focusing on what you don't have on all the lack on all the negativity that is so easy to get distracted by right so um make sure that whatever dreams you have whatever passions you have that you stay focused on that and you use your energy wisely on the things that you love, on the things that you want versus to the things that you don't want. Um, and I always like to say like, you know, eliminate as many negative things in your life as you can. That includes people, places, situations that just are not in alignment with you. And I know for myself, a lot of times I, I'm a people pleaser and I want to make everybody else happy. And sometimes it comes at the expense of my own happiness and my own um, life. And um, I'm, I'm still learning, you know, to say it's not selfish to put myself first because my happiness comes first. Because our happiness affects everything, including our health, most importantly, our health. So make sure that you stay happy, so that you stay sane and take care of you first before you try to take care of other people and other things. Um, with that said, I love you guys so much. I will see you in the next one and you have an amazing rest of the day. Take care.